here's a section of uh, of an Impala and I uh, just want to show you the difference between one side and the other. So this side might not look too bad. The yeah, paint's a little faded. Got a little rust at the edge there. This is what most people see on the outside of their car. Just a little bit of rust there. Okay, but if we look on the other side, as you can see, it's all very rusty. No paint, all rust. Fortunately, we deal with rust. So this doesn't even concern me. I know how to fix that. So in order to remove the rust easy, one way would be with a, a wire wheel and a drill, if you really uh, don't have a whole lot of tools. That would do it, but wire wheel won't get behind this edge here. Okay, this little edge right here. Can't reach in there with too many tools. Not to mention a wire wheel is a lot of work, and it doesn't really get all the rust off. So, my method for uh, non-structural parts, uh, body metal, things like that, um, is to soak it in muriatic acid. Muriatic acid. Picked up a couple of gallons of this I found for free. Can't beat that price. And uh, got a tub here. Since I only got a few gallons and need to do uh, a fairly long part, not too wide, just long, I'm using this tub at an angle. Have it propped up. And removing a rust is just as simple. Oh, and you don't want to splash this stuff because uh, it will burn you a little bit. There we go. Part in the muriatic acid. And we're removing rust. I'll leave that in there overnight. Come back tomorrow. And once I pull it out, hose it off with some water, wash it with some soapy water, neutralize the acid. Let it dry. It'll uh, come out with no rust, bare steel, but it will flash rust since we're in a very humid environment here. Flash rust, however, is very easy to take care of also. Using Osfo. Osfo. Phosphoric acid. Ready's rusted surfaces for painting. Great stuff, great stuff. I love it. It's about $50 a gallon, but well worth it. A little bit of acid goes a long way. It's real thin stuff. And after we wipe it down with Osfo, it comes out looking like this. Okay, this is a piece from the other side. It was just as rusty as the one we put in the tank there about a day ago. But as you can see, it's all very clean now. Let's see if I can get better lighting on here. All right, all the way around the edges. Nice, clean, new metal and no rust. This piece is from uh, about a 65 or 66. So it's in great shape for uh, that old. No rusted out holes. And this will be the piece that we replace the rusted piece with. Tomorrow I'll get a wire wheel in here to remove the paint. Paint stripper if it takes it. And uh, then we'll weld it in place, prime it, paint it. It'd be good as new. So that's how I deal with some of the rusty parts. And that's also where some of the rust is on your car that you don't see. Just because you can't see it doesn't mean it's not there. Lift up your carpet sometime. Lift up the trunk mat. You'll see. 
especially with these old cars.